you're weak, you're falling apart, and you're crazy. You're everything that the narcissist told people that you were. A liar. You're abusive to them. You're lunatic and delusional and crazy. These are all the things that the narcissist will say to you when you cry in front of them. If you think your tears, crying and pleading and begging and holding on the leg of your narcissist is going to get them to somehow see or feel your pain, you are sadly mistaken. A narcissist, they don't see or feel the emotions of such like you do. They have no empathy. And nor do they see the pain that they're causing you when you cry in front of the narcissist. Your tears are more like victory for a narcissist. See, you must remember that a narcissist is broken. Broken to no repair. So when you cry in front of them, they feel better about their insecurities. They feel better about the hatred that they feel for themselves. They feel better that someone else is experiencing what they feel every day of their lives. See, a narcissist is not like you and I, where if we hurt someone, we take a step back. We might even hug that person. We might even apologize to that person. We might even try to rewrite our wrongs and talk about it. Nah, uh, uh, not for a narcissist. In a narcissist's head, honey, your tears are, as I'm going to continuously say, your tears for a narcissist is victory. See, a narcissist get high off of you crying. They're not going to step back and apologize. Instead, they will celebrate. You crying in front of a narcissist, honey? As I said before, and I'm going to say it again, it's the ultimate victory. See, they get a high off of that. Stop crying in front of a narcissist. See, every time you go through something with a narcissist, purposely done, might I say. They get a hit, honey. They get high, 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 high. Every time. They push you to your limit and make you cry. They love it. So the next time you think about crying in front of a narcissist, don't. Because they look at you and they see crying as a weakness. That's why you'll never see them cry. Oh, they do though. Yeah, so stop crying in front of a narcissist because... Right after that cry, they're going to treat you like you are the ugliest person in the world. Like you're nasty. Like you're a bug on their windshield that they must get off. Stop crying in front of a narcissist. If you haven't figured it out by now, a narcissist runs away from any type of accountability or any type of emotions that just might make them feel human. In fact, here's a fact, a narcissist feel hatred towards you when they cry. They feel disgusted towards you when you cry. Stop crying in front of a narcissist. We know that that's not normal. When a person cries, most people feel empathy. They feel remorse. Not a narcissist. Stop crying. In front of a narcissist. And don't think I don't understand. 
Because I've tried to open my heart to a narcissist. And honey, just what I'm telling you right now is the very thing that I experience. Stop crying, please, in front of a narcissist. They look at you as a nuisance. That's not normal. Your husband, your father, your mother, your sister, your brother, your aunt, whoever the narcissist is. You cry in front of them, and they look at you like you are a piece of crap. Like you are, as I said, a nuisance. Stop crying in front of the narcissist. Don't you see, by now, you crying, they could care less about your tears. In their mind, they're thinking how you're taking the attention away from them. They don't care about your tears or anything else about you. Please stop crying in front of a narcissist. Listen, the blank stare and the burden attitude as if you're a burden, that's what they give towards you and the abandonment feeling well actually they actually abandon you directly after that they leave out the house don't come back mine didn't come back for days I experienced exactly what you've experienced do not cry in front of a narcissist I remember watching Andrew Benjamin I remember watching Angie. I remember watching Narc Survivor and uh, Suvak, I think his name was, guy from UK. And I remember watching several videos on when you cry in front of a narcissist. And I said, you know what? That can't be true. Let me see if that's true. So when the opportunity arose, I took that opportunity. And I fake cried. I even had my grandson cracking up. He was like, you crazy, yeah, yeah. And lo and behold, the information that each channel on YouTube was giving people was far more than correct. I cried on the leg. I grabbed around the ankle of his leg as he was walking out. And see, they sweat. Well, I know mine sweat profusely. And he was wiping his head and he gave me the look. Just looking at me like I was utterly disgusted. Like I was poo-poo doo-doo on him. While I'm on his leg saying, please. He looking at me, wiping his head. Looking down at me. Listen to me. A narcissist sees your tears as nothing more than they've broken you. Victory and mission accomplished. Stop crying in front of a narcissist. Listen. Stop being a burden to someone that is a burden to you. Stop looking crazy to a person that's acting crazy to you. And don't allow someone to dismiss you and avoid you and reject you and abandon you because someone else has done that to them. Be brave. Be strong. And be a winner to you. Please, don't cry 
in front of a narcissist. Stay strong, my friend, my sister, my brother. Don't let them win. The burden that they say you are, the dismissal that they give you, an abandonment feeling that they make you feel that emptiness and you feeling alone. That blank stare while you're pouring out your heart and your soul to them. Don't let them win. Don't give them that right to have over you. Don't cry in front of that narcissist. Because in the end, just like Jesus, you win. You win. In the end, You win. Yep. You win. Just like I did.